How was God created? Great question. Uh, God wasn't created. Now, here's what you have to realize about that. People are like, what do you mean how was God created? What, God had no beginning? No, God is an eternal being. So there's no beginning, there's no middle, there's no end. The reason we think God was created is because we were created with the mindset of time. God is not created with the mindset of time. Time was made for us. It was developed, created, and enveloped for us. God stands outside of the realm of space and energy and gravity and time. He made all of these laws, but he lives independently of them. It's kind of like the laptop or the computer that you use or even the iPhone that you hold in your hand. The person that designed it, the person that made the software is not inside making everything work. They made it, and yet they live and operate independent of it. And that's how God, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. He made it, but then he put the world in its own consequence, as it were. And so the world lives out uh, its own decision-making process, and God is independent of time, independent of space. So nobody made him, but he certainly, in eternity past, knew that he was going to make us. Did you know before there was ever an earth, before there was ever even a creation, The Bible says that Jesus was the lamb slain before the foundations of the world. You see, there's only been one plan for the redemption of humanity, and it's always been the gospel. God has never had a plan B. Plan A has always been Jesus Christ, the death, the burial, and the resurrection. So God had no beginning. God will have no end. Now, get this. Because God has no beginning, that's difficult for us to fathom. But think about this. We are made by God. In God's image, which means because we are made in God's image, God is a being of eternality. So once we come into existence, guess what? We're eternal beings. You're going to live forever somewhere. You're going to get saved and live forever in heaven, or you're going to die in your sin and live forever in the lake of fire. But forever you are an eternal being now because God created you in his image And before we were ever created, God's always been eternal because that's what makes him God. No beginning and no ending. All right?